Good afternoon, good evening, welcome back to Get Fit Maryville, where you can see all of our videos, our blogs, our updates at getfitmaryville.com. You can get to our YouTube channel, you can get to our Facebook fan page. Thank you very much on Facebook. We're up to 559 likes, that's fantastic. Continuing on with the alphabet, as uh, you can see, I'm a little bit uh, winded, a little sweaty. Going to do a little demonstration today as well as continue on with our letter in the alphabet. And the next letter here, if you've been following along, is the letter J. And the word that I have chosen for the letter J is justify. And that word has a lot of different meanings. I'm going to kind of break it into a couple different things. We're going to talk about your health. We're going to talk about your family. We're going to talk about your work life. Okay, all three very important things, because without any of those things, definitely upsets the balance. So the question is, is it's not if I'm going to work out today, but why am I working out today? How do you justify in your mind how to make that choice? What happens if you don't work out? You don't feel as good, you're a little tired, maybe your family life suffers a little bit because you don't have the energy or your body's breaking down, you have issues. Maybe it affects your work life. Maybe at work you're not concentrating as much, you don't feel so good, you're getting headaches, you got back aches. These are the kind of things that I like to throw at people and think about when they talk to me about their health and how they justify not working out versus working out or taking the time or dedicating themselves to that. So food for thought. What I'm going to demonstrate today is a modification. I've got a couple of different things down here. I've got a dumbbell and a kettlebell, as well as some body weight. And what I'm going to do is perform a swing followed by push-ups. And as you can see, uh, it works. And I'll kind of break down the rep ranges for you in a second. So I'm going to just set this here. Now, if you have kettlebells, Get yourself a medium range weighted one. Put your feet about shoulder width apart. Drop it down. We're going to throw it back. Snap up with the hips. Like so. If you don't have a kettlebell at your disposal, try a dumbbell. Get a nice grip on it from the side. And again, snap those hips. Back neutral. Going to drop it down. What I recommend for that, for the rep range, is to try and go five to ten rounds of about twenty repetitions apiece. Okay. One minute rest in between each, so you do 20 swings, 20 push-ups, one minute rest. See how that works for you. If that's too much, try five and five, try 10 and 10, but the key to it, obviously, get yourself sweaty, get yourself motivated, justify making it a great workout and a great day. I want to thank everybody for watching. Let's get it done.